Lisa. Today I'm going to be showing you how to fix a very common issue on your bang wigs. All right, so I want to come on here today and give you guys a good old fashioned tutorial. And I wanted to just dive right into this. This is something that I've actually done a lot of mini videos and sent them to people personally because they've had this problem. And I was like, I need a video for this. So I'm going to give you guys a full length video on how to actually fix something that happens a lot with bang wigs, especially ones that you're getting that are not lace front. They're going to have this rubber top on them. And with shipping, a lot of times with these bang wigs, what happens is they are shipped very flat like this in a package. They get shipped to the person that is selling them to you. And then they also are going to get shipped to you. So what will happen is because of this, you'll get this really gorgeous wig in, looks beautiful, looks amazing. Put it on your head and you have a cone shaped situation happening up here. So I want to show you guys how to fix that. Literally one thing, all you're going to need is a flat iron. You want to set it to the lowest setting. So the lowest setting on this one is going to be 280. So I'm going to put it on that. If it goes lower, that's even better because you really don't need a lot of heat to do this trick. Take that rubber part that is right here on the top of the wig and literally kind of sandwich it in between these two layers. And you're just going to want to open and kind of close along this rubber area. I kind of start at the part and then I just kind of go from side to side and I want to just kind of warm this rubber up. I don't need it to be scalding hot. It doesn't need to be burning. I just want to get it nice and warm and you want to either take it and put it onto a wig head immediately while it's still warm to the touch or right onto your own head is fine as well. And then take your hands and just kind of smooth it down. Take your hands, rub it down, Get it to where it feels kind of nice and smooth and flat. And you're going to do this until it kind of gets a little bit cooler to the touch and then just let it sit there. And then when you take it off, it's going to be formed to the shape of the wig head or to your own head. It's that easy. And it's something that like, as soon as I kind of put the pieces together and figured out, I was like, oh my gosh, this is so easy. It makes so much sense. But I didn't realize that I hadn't filmed it for you guys. So I wanted to show you guys exactly how to do it. All right, so as you can see, it's much flatter on my head and really fits my head shape a lot better. So I hope this hack was really helpful for you guys. Like I said, it's super easy to do and just something I wanted to make sure I had here for you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the next one. Take it away, what did you do? I just can't get enough. Too caught up in your love. Stop.